Welcome back to Midpoint. President of the Space and Science Research Corporation, a former White House space program advisor, author of the book Dark Winter. Now, the sun is causing a 30-year cold spell. It is available online, Amazon, any bookstore as well. It is an important book to read simply because it provides factual information as to where we are really going right now. John Casey joins us in studio. Let's bring this back again to this coming winter. If you look at what you've talked about, we are looking at a potential, and I don't want to undersell or oversell this, but a really potentially disastrous winter in many parts of the country. How then, why are we not better prepared for this? Why have we waited to this point to where it's come to the cliff and now we're going to fall off? Exactly, and we'll soon be issuing a press release indicating we are literally falling off the global temperature cliff in the next few years. The reason is because we've been operating under a media and politically driven scenario of man-made global warming caused by CO2. Uh, we now know after 30 years and 30 billion dollars that the greenhouse gas theory really was always a bad theory. That the CO2 models and the global climate models developed using that theory are wholly unreliable. They've been proven to be just way off target in predicting climate variation. And on the other hand, if you look at what the sun is doing and make your models for climate change based on solar activity, they're oftentimes more than 90% reliable. So we got off on the wrong track decades ago. We're still there. Who put us on that wrong track? Well, you have to go back and look at how this started. It, it began as an effort to uh, end coal strikes in Great Britain. It led to nuclear power generation. We're talking decades now. We're talking decades ago. And uh, all of a sudden, the UN picked up on this greenhouse gas theory, passed it on to President Bill Clinton and now President Barack Obama. It's become a, uh, a theory du jour for the Democratic Party and any progressive movement that wants to impose greater control over the people using the greenhouse gas theory as a tool. I don't want to scare people again, but we have to deal with some facts here. Are we then looking at, thanks to your book, Dark Winter, and other research regarding the sun, a period of revolution, war, famine, because of what we're going through right now and we're not prepared? If one studies history, and goes back and look at every 206 year period when this solar hibernation, these cold eras arrive, you have to conclude that the same thing's going to repeat. What happens is typically the big hit is to the crops. Once the crops begin to get damaged by this record cold that's coming, people starve, people get uh, riotous, angry. Uh, people talk about the war cycle also during these periods. Furthermore, the largest earthquakes and volcanic eruptions also occur at the bottom of these cold cycles. Is there any idea as to when it would cease? This cycle that we're in right now, what are we looking at? With 10, 20, 30 years of this, where do we go? We're looking at the 2030s, uh, the late 2020s, 2030s being the worst, and then we start to warm up, but only moderately so in the 2040s. But I don't think we're ever gonna see the kind of global warming we just left. Are we going to look at a point where the president and those who follow and those, the Democrats as well, and who believe in the other forms of global warming are going to look at themselves one day and say, wow, how, how foolish were we? Or are we already there? Uh, we're pretty close. Uh, the situation, though, after 18 years with no global warming, and yet look how intense the government is pushing global warming mm -hmm. when we have none. Uh, look how intense the deception is for telling the truth about the status of the, of the Earth's climate, much less where it's going to be in 5, 10, or 20 years. So even at the worst of this, I still expect there'll be some people saying, oh, just wait a few more decades, it'll get warm again caused by CO2. <sighs> I'm going out to buy my warm clothes right away. Uh, by the way, I want to remind everybody, the book is called Dark Winter, How the Sun is Causing a 30-Year Cold Spell. You can get John Casey's Dark Winter free with this special offer available at Newsmax.com slash Dark Winter. Make sure you pick up this book. Learn, because it is worth knowing. Do not let someone just give you one side of the story. John, a pleasure to see you again. Thanks so Thank much for you, coming Ed. back. And we'll be back right here on Midpoint.